Hi everyone, it's Kathleen. If you are like me and love Daphne's diary, then this is the hoarding video for you. These are older products, magazines, books, day timers that I have in my stash and we'll be creating journals. This is unfinished, but creating journals like this for myself. Also, I want to share with you my new delivery from Daphne's Diary. So years ago, I ordered at various times the Daphne's Diary Planner. I have, it looks like an unused 2018 diary. And this one, oh, I'm losing, I'm losing my books. This is an unused 2018 diary that I will be tearing apart to create journals with for my own personal use. 2018, 2019, I have used already, but I saved, maybe I saved some of the pieces here and I started to cover them up. So I will be taking these out and creating journals with you. So right now I'm just sharing my stash. These were pages. I really like how you can put an old book page on Daphne's diary and get a beautiful insert. So I have 18, 19, and 20. Is this used? Oh yes. This is a used day timer that I have not started to cover or anything. So I have used this already. And when I take it apart, that will be another one. So 18, 19, 20. In my box. Oh, maybe I don't have a 21. This is a 23. I just ordered this. This is brand new. I have not even, well, it's 23. It's coming up for next year. I have this. I will be using this one as a diary. Uh, sorry, a planner. And I showed you how I already have started to do some of these pages. And then I have all of these old magazines. Old magazines starting, what year is this? Because of my OCD, when I buy something, I like to get the whole collection of it or else it's incomplete to me. And if it's not complete, it drives me crazy. I get an attack. So this is 2021. And so volumes at that time, that must have been when I purchased it. I have vol number six. So look, just look at these covers. And they're going to make journals approximately like this. So they're going to be gorgeous. I want the name Daphne's Diary on my journals when I create them. So I have these. And I'm just showing you the ones I have. And each magazine will be made into a journal. Only for personal use because copyright laws, you're not allowed to sell these specific Daphne's Diary journals with their paper in it or her paper in it. What year? 21? Number six, number five, number four. Oh, I should show you the backs of these. Oh my God. So it's not only the front. Number six. Just look at that. Number five. This is 2021. Look how gorgeous that is. Issue four. These are old ones. Issue three or number three. Love the watercolor, love the fonts, love everything about it. Personal journals. Number two. And number one from 2021. This is older, so what is this? This is 2019 and 2019. I was only able to get these two old issues of that particular year. This is issue five. And it's more of a gloss finish on this. I prefer the matte issue, the matte finish, I mean. And look at this. 
This is number three from 2019. Absolutely gorgeous. They had a Daphne's Diary wedding special planner. I'm 60. I'll never be marrying again, so look at this. But why did I want it? Because it's so beautiful on the inside. Why is it upside down? That's kind of interesting. Oh, it's like a wedding planner. Okay, we will look through that later. So these are all old archives. Oh my gosh, that is heavy. And when I ordered this 2023 planner, in my package was this. I didn't order this, but oh my, it's nice. I wasn't sure whether... What I'm gonna, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this, but it's an empty, looks like a six by six, nice, nice, heavy quality paper. So I don't know if I'm gonna rip that apart and use it, but this one is gonna, this is 23. I am using that one as a planner, like I said many times. So without further ado, let's grab some scissors and Let's see what I received. This was opened by Canada Customs. I live in Canada. This box cost me $163. So let's see what's inside. It was checked by Customs in Canada because I had a note from them. Like we have a whole bunch of lovely smash tissue thanks to border border security border checking so they had to check and see what i was ordering doing their job okay omg let's take this out of the box and see what we have here oh my goodness wow okay this looks like it's upside down. Oh my goodness. Do we have anything else in the box? Torn tissue. Thank you, border security. Okay. Let's, it looks like it's upside down. So I'm just, oh, so this is my 2022. That's this current year, of course. I got it because I wanted to collect all the planners. I don't have 2021. So let's flip this over and see what I got. Okay, push this to the side and... Alrighty. Okay, so these, something like this even can be used in our journals when we create it. It's a thank you for your order. And putting that to the side. And this is a 2022 planner. Most of you have seen these. Her, her imagery is gorgeous. She has pockets. Like just gorgeous stuff in here. Whoa. And different. This is postcards. I'm just flipping through this fast. This was discontinued or on sale, I think, in, in the Daphne shop. So I bought this to use for images. Beautiful images that we could use, or I could use in my personal journals that I'm going to create. Oh my. Okay. And it's way different. I'm used to doing vintage journals. So Daphne's diary for me is totally different. And I like her little pockets at the back, so I might be using the front cover and the back cover for myself to create a journal with. 
with the other one. So I'll put that back. And let's, oh my, look at this. That's so gorgeous. Let's see what I got in the bag. I got a nice bag I could use inside the bag. Looks like a postcard, a bingo sticker. Don't know if I will use that, but we're going to tuck that in the bag to see what I got. These are some more of her stickers. I did buy her sticker books in the past. I use them to decorate envelopes or packages that I mail. Oh, that's pretty. Corals and greens. Very nice. They're almost like book plates or flower cards. Oh, look at this teapot. Oh, the beautiful little girl. And this. So these little freebies that are included here will be included in my journals that I made. Okay, look at that. That is a big flower, not flower plant poster. Alrighty, so that will be used somehow. So, I got... Alright, so I got a planner and how many magazines? A planner and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight magazines for 153 Canadian dollars. Multiply that by 1.25 for U.S. funds. So it'll be in Canada. It's, it's more money than in the U.S. So let's put this away. And I'm just going to show you the front covers. I'm not going to leaf through all the diary, all the books. So this is, this is, let's see if I can have them in order. So what year did I buy? 22... Six, five, four, three, two, one. And this is 21. So I have 21. And these are the last two that I needed for my collection. This is the year 2021. This is number seven. The front and the back. Wow. These are so pretty. So I wasn't sure whether I'd be... Creating the journals this way. This is how I sent Lisa hers, is this way. Or if I would turn it around and do the other way. I'm not sure yet, but this is one of the Daphne's Diary magazines. Oh, that's beautiful. So 2021, number seven. This must be number eight. Make your own Christmas decorations. This is so pretty. So can you even imagine like long, narrow journals made with these? So the back cover could be used as a long, skinny journal maybe for me. And the front cover, because I want all mine the same, I'm not sure whether I'll be making them like that or this way. I don't know yet. We'll see. So what is that? 21? And are these 22? Yes, they are. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. So this is the current year. Number 1, 2022. I've seen this mustard color one being used quite a bit online. Let's see what the inside cover is on this one. Ooh, it looks like there's a poster in here. Okay, so this is issue one, issue two. This is issue three, number three. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my, she's added papers in here. Oh. Uh -oh. 
colors. Oh my, look at this. Wow. Just look at that. These are going to make gorgeous journals. And again, personal journal. Oh, look at that. I got this in a separate sheet. I'm flipping fast because I don't want to spend time flipping through them. Oh, I love that pink. Oh, look at this. Just gorgeous. So these are going to be modern, modern journals. I've seen this red one also online. When I say online, I mean YouTube. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, geez, this is going to be very pretty. So what do we have here? Sometimes she has a poster. Oh, look at that. Poster in there. Oh, lovely. Okay, so it looks like, oh my, what is that? Washi tape? Or I can put my own sugueing tape at the back and make my own washi tape with this. How lovely is that? Oh, my. Okay, this is going to be very fun to create these journals. Wow. Look, I love vintage, so this one is gorgeous. Ocean poster. What issue is this? This one is number five. So it looks like there's papers in the back of her new issues. Oh, gosh, I love that. Oh, yeah, I have another one of these that must have been mailed to me somehow, this uh, posted, this ocean poster. I'm going to stick it on Sawyer's door. Oh, nice. Wow. So if any of you are going to be brave enough, and create your personal Daphne's Diary journals with me. I would love to have you join me on my upcoming videos. I still will be doing my Edith Holden journals, but these are my personal journals I thought I would tackle. Remember I told you this is number six. Told you now that since I turned 60, I decided I wanted to do do more things for me. I oh my, look at this! Wow, Rolls, blues. Okay, we are going to have how many papers is that? And again, the covers are just amazing. I love their matte feel. And this is one paper, two papers, three. Looks like she gives you, oh wow, looks like she gives you papers in here and we're going to be doing, oh my goodness. Okay, so I think I was initially going to be creating journals oldest to newest, but I think I am just going to, and I don't have any more uh, things ordered, so for me this would be my, oh, I wonder if that's that same poster that I got as a freebie. I will start with this, the newest. I've been looking online for these uh, blueberry um, bread pudding type desserts. I wonder if that's what that is. It says cherry, but I guess. Wow, look at this. Oh my goodness. Okay. So when I create, I'm going to my own personal journals. Wow. I will be starting with the most current edition. Oh my Lord, is that gorgeous. And that would be this one. This is number six. Oh, wow. Okay. Usually when I create a journal, I like to just keep, keep with the same one magazine and create a journal out of it. So we'll see how, how that goes. If I have extras, well, 
then it looks like, Lisa, you'll be getting an extra, an extra journal out of these because I can't sell them, but I can sure give them away. Look at that. Okay, that's all I wanted. <laughs> I've got far to line up all these journals. <laughs> OMG. How many? How, oh, good God. How many? So how many journals will I be making? Let's have a look here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. And there's the front and the back. So seventeen times two journals that I will be making out of these in a traveler's notebook style journal. And then still don't know what I'm going to make out of that. But these, that's my, going to be my planner for the next year. But we have this 2020, 2019, and 2018. Look at how gorgeous that is. Journals that I'm going to make. And do I make them like I'm going to? Small little ones like that, cut in half. Whoops. Oh, this big stack over. Small little journals cut in half. Maybe whatever that is. I don't know, four by five. And then that being the bat, another journal. Good question. Good question. Oh, oh, she has it different. So that's what I'm up to. I got my order today and I was so excited to share it with you. And that is Daffy's Diary, everyone. I'm finished, just about finished doing a, uh, my next, my Create Playbook. And look at this. I used to make precedent pages when I created my Edith Holden journals. I have, well, right now I have two of these ones on the go. And these are from my precedent pages. These, I'll have one, I have another one. These are on the go. So personal, I'll start after I finish my one turquoise, my Create Playbook that is done. I'm just gluing on my snippets today. And then I have these two that are just about done course we're going to cover them up with some beautiful stitching and on to Daphne. Lots of projects on the go. Thank you everyone for watching and I hope you'll join me for my personal creating my personal journals. This one's not finished. This was just a prototype I did years ago. Similar to Lisa's but off we go. Thanks everyone for watching my Hoarding selection of Daphne's Diary magazines. Bye for now.